Let's see together how to use Smarther AC combined with the HVAC actuator to manage fan coil system. After installing both devices, power up the system. Create the Zigbee network to pair the devices together. Press the button on the top right of the thermostat until this icon appears. Click on the button Prod of the FCU actuator. After a few seconds, the green LED lights up. Repeat this operation for all the other FCU actuators in the system. When all the LED of the actuators go green, click once more the button on the top right of the thermostat and wait until the icon turns off altogether with all the LEDs of the actuators. The thermostat and the fan coil actuators are now associated in the same Zigbee network. Once Home Plus Control app has been downloaded, launch it and log in. When the app is first launched, it prompts you to add a device. Select brand and select Smarther AC from the list of products. To start the configuration, the app asks to activate the Wi-Fi between smartphone and thermostat. To activate it, press and hold the button on the upper right hand side of the thermostat until the letters AP appear. Confirm the Wi-Fi icon is flashing blue. Now select the correct Wi-Fi to use and if necessary, enter the password. The app scans the network and shows the thermostat that has been found. Select it. Next, select which room the thermostat is in. You can use one already existing or create a new one. Rename the Smarther AC. That name will be recognized by the vocal assistant too. The setup of the thermostat is now completed. Now let's configure the actuator. From the menu, Setting, select Add Product, select Brand, and the fan coil unit actuator. It will show the actuators present in the system and previously added into the Zigbee network. Select the one to configure and set parameters related to the fan coil to be managed as typology, valve, and fan type. Select the modality of temperature control if hysteresis or proportional integral. If hysteresis type, insert the specific parameters. Rename the actuator. This will name the device to control it with the vocal assistant. Confirm to finish the actuator configuration. The operations described for this actuator must be repeated for all the actuators in the system. 